Imagine a lone traveler, a silent wanderer on an endless road. Voyager 1. Built by human hands, it's now a silent emissary in the cosmic ocean, carrying a greeting from our small blue world. Its journey is our journey, driven by the same curiosity that makes us look up and wonder, what's out there? Voyager 1 is more than wires and circuits, it's a testament to human ingenuity and our urge to explore. Launched decades ago, it still whispers back from the void, rewriting our understanding of the universe. It's the first human-made object to plunge into interstellar space, a true pioneer. Its voyage is measured in billions of kilometers and decades of silent flight, outlasting its mission and even its creators. The technology guiding it is ancient, yet it perseveres in the harshest environment imaginable. Voyager 1 is a lonely sentinel, a ghost ship on the solar wind, carrying our hopes and dreams. Its legacy is not just scientific, but a shift in our cosmic perspective. As we follow its path, we're reminded, we are small, but we reach for the stars. From the first humans who crossed continents to this robotic explorer, the impulse is the same, to see what lies beyond. So, let's embark on this journey together. Let's follow Voyager 1 as it sails into the great cosmic dark, forever changing how we see our universe. In the late 1970s, a rare cosmic alignment offered a unique chance. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune lined up, allowing NASA to use gravity assists, cosmic slingshots, to visit them all. This grand tour became the Voyager missions. The Voyagers were built tough and smart, with onboard computers to handle problems far from home. Solar panels wouldn't work that far out, so they used nuclear batteries, still powering them decades later. Two spacecraft, Voyager 2 launched first, on a longer path to all four giants. Voyager 1 launched second, on a faster route to Jupiter and Saturn. The mission was planned for just five years. No one imagined they'd still be sending data from the edge of the solar system over 40 years later. The launch was a leap into the cosmic ocean, our eyes and ears in the far reaches. These probes were built to answer fundamental questions about our planetary neighborhood. The Grand Tour was a bold gamble, using physics to turn dreams into reality. Voyager 1's journey is a testament to our ability to dream big. It's a story of resilience, curiosity, and the power of human ingenuity, and it all began with a rare alignment and a daring plan. Voyager 1's journey through the outer solar system was spectacular. In 1979, it reached Jupiter, revealing the Great Red Spot as a raging hurricane and discovering new moons and rings. The biggest surprise, Io, a volcanic world, spewing sulfur plumes, showing worlds could be heated by gravity, not just sunlight. After Jupiter, Voyager 1 used its gravity to slingshot to Saturn. In 1980, it gave us our first detailed look at Saturn's rings, thousands of icy ringlets, strange spokes and tiny shepherd moons. It flew by Titan, confirming its thick, nitrogen-rich atmosphere, but the surface remained hidden in haze. This glimpse of Titan's chemistry inspired future missions. With its primary mission complete, Saturn's gravity flung Voyager 1 out of the planetary plane. Now, it was on a one-way trip toward the stars. Voyager 1 transformed distant points of light into dynamic complex worlds. Its discoveries rewrote textbooks and inspired generations. The tour of giants was over, but the real adventure was just beginning. After Saturn, Voyager 1 entered the vast emptiness beyond the planets. Its new mission, find the edge of our solar system, the sun creates a magnetic bubble, the heliosphere, protecting us from harsh interstellar radiation. But where did it end? Voyager 1 was searching for the heliopause, the true frontier. Scientists expected a clear boundary, but Voyager found a turbulent chaotic region instead. Solar particles dropped, rose, and the magnetic field flipped back and forth, a messy dynamic frontier. In August 2012, the data changed, solar particles vanished, cosmic rays surged. After months of analysis it was confirmed. Voyager 1 had crossed the heliopause. For the first time, a human-made object was sampling the stuff of the Milky Way. It was a quiet, monumental achievement. Voyager 1 became our first interstellar explorer. The edge of the sun's domain was not a line, but a complex, shifting frontier. The cosmic ocean awaited. Scientists once pictured the heliosphere as a smooth, comet-shaped bubble with a crisp edge. They expected Voyager 1 to find a neat transition, a sudden magnetic shift marking the boundary. Instead, reality was far messier. Voyager crossed the termination shock in 2004, entering a chaotic region called the Heliosheath. 
The solar wind slowed, heated, and tumbled, nothing like the calm models predicted. The heliopause itself was a frothing, turbulent frontier, not a simple wall. When Voyager finally crossed in 2012, solar particles vanished, and cosmic rays flooded in, just as expected. But the magnetic field didn't change direction. This was a shock, forcing scientists to rethink how our sun interacts with the galaxy. The boundary was more complex than anyone imagined. Voyager 1 showed that the universe rarely matches our tidy predictions. The real frontier is dynamic, surprising, and far more interesting. Voyager's discoveries continue to challenge and inspire. Voyager 1 measured the interstellar medium directly for the first time. By listening to plasma waves, it revealed the interstellar gas was denser and more variable than expected. Space isn't a smooth void, it's full of clumps and clouds. These findings reshape our understanding of how stars and planets form. Another surprise, the intensity of galactic cosmic rays. Inside the heliosphere the sun shields us, outside Voyager found a torrent of raw cosmic radiation. This highlights how vital our solar bubble is for life on Earth. The biggest mystery remains the magnetic field. The expected shift never came, suggesting a complex intertwined connection between the sun and the galaxy. The boundary is not a wall, but a porous, dynamic, interface. Voyager 1 revealed a frontier where two magnetic domains mingle in unexpected ways. The universe it turns out is full of surprises. Attached to Voyager 1 is the Golden Record, a time capsule for the cosmos. This gold-plated disc holds images, sounds and music from Earth, curated by Carl Sagan's team. It's a greeting to any future finders, a handshake across billions of kilometers and years. The record's contents are a mosaic of humanity, DNA, music from Bach to Chuck Berry, greetings in 55 languages, and sounds of our world. Its cover is an instruction manual, showing where we come from and how to play the record. The odds of it being found are tiny, but that's not the point. Creating the record was an act of self-reflection, what best represents all of humanity. The golden record is a symbol of hope, and our desire to connect with the cosmos. It's a message to ourselves as much as to the stars. Voyager 1 carries our story into the endless night. It's a testament to our optimism and curiosity. Even if never found, it marks our place in the universe. A silent ambassador, forever journeying, Voyager 1 has changed our understanding of the universe and our place within it. We now know our solar system has a physical boundary, a protective bubble called the heliosphere. Voyager provided the first direct measurements of the interstellar medium, its density, temperature, magnetic field, and radiation. This data is the foundation for new theories and future exploration. Voyager is the scout mapping the unknown. Its journey isn't over. It speeds away at over 61,000 km h, destined to pass near another star in 40,000 years. Its instruments will fall silent, but the spacecraft will orbit the Milky Way for millions of years. Voyager 1 is now a permanent artifact of humanity. Its legacy is both scientific and symbolic. It embodies our spirit of exploration and our refusal to stay home. Voyager reminds us, we are driven to reach for the unknown. It is our silent ambassador, carrying a golden record and the story of a small, curious species. As it sails into the dark, it inspires us to keep exploring. The journey continues into the endless night.